You guys are live in Dallas, Texas on the Founder BB Show. I'd like to let my listening audience know that I have the opportunity to speak to Tony Parnell, and he's been diagnosed with thyroid cancer, and which was kind of frightening because he's a vocalist, but it's frightening for anyone because they told me thyroid cancer is America's fastest growing cancer. And then we have president-elect of the American Association of Clinical Oncologists, and he'll be talking with us and giving us that medical view. Thank you guys for joining us. Thank you. Thank you. And Dr. Mar Dr. Mack, and do I say Harnell? Harrell? Harold. Harold. Okay, I got that real easy. Thank you guys so much for joining us. I'd like to get the medical version of thyroid cancer, and then we're going to get uh, the actual layman term for Tony. The, you know, Dr. Harold, would you tell us, first of all, what is thyroid cancer, and why is it considered the fastest growing cancer in America? Well, Walter, I, I am an endocrinologist, not an oncologist. I feel very sorry. This is one of the uh, few cancers that are taken care of by gland doctors, the endocrinologists of the world. So my job is to be an expert in thyroid-related things. And it turns out the thyroid is a very important gland that lies at the base of the neck, below the Adam's apple, and that it moves when you swallow. And if you develop a lump in this gland, the first thing you want to do is go to your doctor and make sure that you do not have a, a thyroid lump that needs further evaluation. Can you find the lump yourself with a self-exam like we women do for breath? You certainly can. Uh, uh, we have a test, a simple swallowing test that everybody can do. Take a glass of water in the morning, take a little sip, lift the chin, and look in the mirror for movement below the Adam's apple, if you see a lump bobbing up and down when you swallow, that's a good sign that you need to see either your primary care doctor or if you're lucky enough to have an endocrinologist local, please see your endocrinologist and get examined and uh, have high resolution ultrasound to evaluate the thyroid gland. Okay, we're going to go to Tony. Tony, I'd like to know you're a vocalist. Uh, uh, this is probably your way of making a living. But how did you find that you had thyroid cancer, and how do you, where are you now? I found out from feeling a lump in my neck and uh, ended up seeing a doctor, and um, it, didn't, uh, it didn't get diagnosed at that first visit, uh, which was in the early 2000s. I was told not to worry about it, so I ended up waiting a little bit, and then finally, seven or eight years later, uh, after being on the road for years and having some strange pains in my neck and so forth, I ended up in the hands of a good doctor and finally went through the process of getting diagnosed. Um, found an incredible surgeon and um, came out the other end uh, very, very blessed to have my voice intact and uh, have gone on to continue touring and making music. I like that. I love a happy ending to a story. Dr. Harrell, let me ask you. What you gave us some ways to find out uh, to treat this problem once if it's found and things like that. What is your biggest recommendation to the people of living? If you want to give them one great piece of advice, I've got a worldwide audience, and I so I know this is not just an American problem. What would be your best advice? My best advice is to be your own uh, best doctor by looking in the mirror every morning as you swallow, and if you go to a doctor and you're not satisfied with what you hear. Don't stop there. That's Don't very stop good there. Advice. That's uh, good advice. And if if you feel that you have a thyroid lump and it's not being evaluated properly, go to your endocrinologist. And to learn more about that, go to thyroidawareness.com, where we have lots of information on the thyroid and about thyroid cancer. Thank you so much, Dr. Harrell. And I'm going to wrap up with you, Tony. I know you must have a new CDL because you said you're blessed. So you got to be happy to sing. you got a new CD for us? I do. Uh, you can go to TonyHarnell.com, and the, the new video just came out, and that will play immediately when you go onto my website. And then underneath, you can, you can click in various places to um, purchase, and, purchase a CD and listen to songs and so forth. And I, asked, I asked Dr. Harrell what was his best advice, and that was a medical advice. Mm. But through someone who has walked through the fire and came out on the other side, What's your best inspiration? 
my best inspiration. Well, my mother was a, quite an inspiration because obviously her situation was much more um, serious and grave than mine was. But I think that uh, uh, you know, really, just that this is not a death sentence, and um, that people should not uh, be afraid to go to the doctor because of the outcome of this. I think it's uh, generally a very good outcome, and uh, thyroid cancer is very treatable, and um, it's a challenge. You know, it definitely wasn't uh, my you know most favorite thing in the world that I've done in my life, but uh, but I came through it, and. Um, that's it. I thank you so very much. That's great inspiration, Tony. Thank, thank you so you. very much for that. And we'll go to your website and take a look at your new CD and take a listen also, too. And Dr. Harrell, thank you so much as president-elect of the American Association of Clinical Endocrinologists. Did I get it right that time? You got it. Thank you so very <laughs> much you. for joining me in Dallas. Thank you.